Hello, as some of you guys might know by now that I am a fan of Taylor Swift and but I'm not really that kind of fan who would spend my money um, to buy her merch or something like that because I am broke and her merch are, you know, generally merch every artist is overpriced so I'm not that kind of fan mm, but I do have quite a number of Taylor Swift related thingy but most of them are something that people got from me instead of me getting it on my own. For example, this casing, someone gave it to me. This bag from 1989, someone gave it to me. This album, someone gave it to me. That poster, someone gave it to me. That one, someone gave it to me as well. Someone gave it to me as well. And there's another poster there, someone else gave it to me. So basically saying, I don't really have anything Taylor Swift related that I got it on my own that I bought with my own money no really but I got this one yes with my own money with my first paycheck as a copywriter I'm working as a copywriter and to into this video I'm going to tell you everything you might want to know everything that I know about this cardigan so first of all I bought it from a website called Avana Asia I think it is a a platform a shopping platform online shopping platform and then at the Taylor Swift I think the Taylor Swift store at the official store under the um, online platform do you get what I mean so basically um, for Southeast Asian punya fans you can buy through Avana Asia because the official um, store diorang, which is from US direct from US diorang tak boleh ship to Malaysia and even if they do Macam mahal gila nak mampus So about the price um, This one The price of this cardigan is RM250 Dia lagi mahal RM50 Berbanding kalau you beli direct from US store Official store Harga asal dia 200 sahaja But I think it is worth it Okay I'm really honest I'm not really sure about this Because I'm bad at math And then I I was impulsive When I was buying this cardigan So malas nak fikir Dia punya pros and cons Why not um, But I think it's a bargain Tapi I, uh, I've read on Twitter Yang orang kata sebenarnya um, Avana Asia is a scam Sebab harga lagi mahal Daripada harga direct shipping US What not But I think For Malaysian fans It is a bargain Because Avana Asia Dia base dia dekat Malaysia So like um, bila Once the stock sampai dekat Avana Asia punya base Which is in Malaysia So dia nak ship ke rumah kita tu Dah murah lah Because um, Kalau for like Indonesian fans ke Macam Philippine fans ke You have to ship to luar negara lagi sekali So like you have to dah Macam bayar mahal lah kan Because if you dalam Malaysia For me this one the shipping fee was only RM8 ringgit Whereas kalau you beli direct from US Which is impossible pun Sebab US tak ada shipping to Malaysia Tapi even if they do The shipping cost only would um, Would cost you RM60 And then dia orang ada shipping tax Shipping shipping fee what not, what not So basically memang akan jadi mahal juga So I think RM258 Is such a bargain Macam very worth it lah Tapi Here's another thing. There is some very crucial um, complaint that I would like to make. First of all, they claim they got website there when I was about to pay, when I was about to order. They, they claim to be 100% um, acrylic yarn. So I expected it to be acrylic yarn. I expected it to be this one. This one is from Pull and Bear. Okay, 100% acrylic from Pull and Bear. I expected it to be very soft and very comfortable and very seju or what not like this one. On the other hand, this one, this one, di macam, do you know if you buy um sweaters from bundles? Yeah, yeah, the feeling is like this. Unfortunately, yes. Because apparently, when I check it here, it is 50% acrylic and 50% polyester. That that is why they much very plasticky, very gata gata, very not comfortable. Macam tak, macam tak 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 shock lah. Nah, what's the weather? By the way, I have the smallest size. I think it's XS SM, but the smallest one lah. And I think the sizing is quite okay. They much above my above my punggung. Eh, not lah really above lah. Macam labu juga. Okay, and then the labu tangan is just okay. Depan macam nampak. Macam oversized So macam very cute 
But this one macam okay lah, just nice. Macam nampak comfy lah. My height is 159, 60, something like that. And my weight is 45, 45, like that. So macam, I'm quite small. So. Okay, another major thing that I notice is the fact that there's, okay, there's this patch right here. It's written folklore album. And there's i think and i think there's another version of this cardigan um they are the instead of instead of the tulis ada patch dekat sini dia tak ada apa-apa dekat sini but dia ada patch tailor sleeve tulis dekat sini okay as you can see mine ada folklore album tapi mine tak ada the tailor sleeve one but if you get the tailor sleeve one you won't get this one get what i mean and i think it's a bummer like kenapa kau tak letak dua-dua and and the worst part is you can gamble. You can't choose you want the folklore patch or you want the Taylor Swift patch. You just can gamble they bagi you which one. And I think dia bukan macam kesal. I think lah, I think dia macam bukan kesalahan. Dia memang ada dua version. I don't understand why, but yeah, that's a fact. I also believe that this is due to the fact that Taylor Swift is now under Universal. And if I'm not mistaken, I've read somewhere that Universal, they memang ada problem dengan merchandise, artist orang. Macam even Ariana Grande, I think Ariana Grande is under Universal juga. And merchandise Ariana Grande pun macam memang selalu ada problem juga. And I saw on on, on Twitter juga yang... Ada banyak komplain jugalah like macam ada berlubang, tangan berlubang like there's three holes lah benda lah macam banyak komplain. So I am glad that I have I don't have any major complaints. So, by the way, um Universal ni your apa punya customer service is quite good. Macam you can get their they they have this customer service WhatsApp number. Um I think ada dekat Albana Asia tu punya website juga. You can get it there. So if ada problem ke apa you can just contact them and they are quite responsive um because masa awal, awal i ordered i i ordered size xl yes i am dumb because i thought i wanted a cardigan yang oversized but apparently when i look it up online i think the other fans pakai xs pun dah cukup besar which is yes xs pun dah cukup besar uh, so i whatsapp there minta tukar and alhamdulillah i got uh, dapat tukar and dapat xs and when I ask them about the material and about the patch also, they orang terus reply. But orang cakap nanti kita check dengan management. Bukan, dia cakap bahasa Inggeris lah. Dia kata nanti dia check dengan management something like that. Nanti dia get back to me. Uh, itu dia penuh reply lagi. But at least dia macam responsive lah. Tak adalah macam dia ignore terus. Tak tahu. Tapi buat yang tukar size tu dia layan. So, and then I baca dekat online juga. Dekat Twitter pun semua. And memang dia orang responsive. Macam kalau ada problem yang major problem. Dia orang akan terus replace what not. So, I think um, kalau you ada masalah macam jangan risau sangat. My overall review would be... Um, kalau benda ni RM250 and dia bukan atas nama Telusif... Taylor Swift, no, I wouldn't buy it. Sebab dia, material dia macam memang tak best and whatnot. Macam ada banyak problem here and there. But because dia atas nama Taylor Swift, so macam boleh tutup nama. Because I love you, Taylor Swift. This is all because of you. So, he, I'm so excited about this cardigan. I love it so much. So, here's a montage video that I did for this cardigan. So, enjoy. Thank you guys for watching.